next called as a business process management tool so actually in the market so there are so many business process management tools available business process management so bpm means business process management so pega comes under this business process management so what is business process management i will tell you so before that so what are the uh, so many tools are there in the market pega so if you heard about lombardi mm, i i can also say oracle so there is also a tool called oracle bpm that is also one bpm tool EL BPM, J BPM, and Tipco. So Tipco, I cannot say it is a totally BPM. It is also a part of the BPM tool. So like this. So in the market, so Epion, Savvy. So so many tools are there. So but when we compare this Pega with other tools, other BPM tools in the market, so Pega is far so behind them. so what are the tools which are available in the market means so there is no competition to this pega tool in the bpm market so mainly why we are using this pega means so this pega is mainly used for developing web based enterprise applications or we can simply say for developing web applications any type of web applications we can develop using this pega bpm tool and in the back end see this total pega is developed using the java environment so actually in the back end this pega tool is developed using the j2e environment see when we take this pega tool so in the back end we can see so automatically it will generate some predefined source code so there is no need to write any coding here so when we so develop anything in this pega environment it will in the back end it will automatically generate the source code so that is one of the so biggest advantage because so why it is generating the source code means so this total pega tool is developed using the j2 environment actually simply saying i can say Yeah, Vasu, mute your microphone. Yeah, uh, Vasu. Yeah, please, a hey, one second here. Yeah, Vasu, mute your microphone. so click on the green symbol so okay thank you so just now i started the session so i'm discussing about the introduction so once again here i'm meeting so pega is comes under bpm category so which is business process management actually this business process management is a methodology so which is already so design so it is a design methodology so which is the main purpose of this business process management is to improve the business performance and at the same time reduce the number of risk at the time of development and also reduce the number of errors and also which saves the development so time and the cost of the application so there are so many features are there i will list you uh, i will briefly list what are the features of this business process management so the main and in simple way we can say so the business process management main feature is for improving the business performance and also it reduces the automation of work so means nothing is done manually here everything is automated in pega so means we will not write any coding at the time of developing an application in pega so everything is done using the drag and drop or point and click here so if you want to develop any application in pega so the automation so everything is inbuilt in the pega tool itself 
so just we have to use those inbuilt features so that is about this pega tool and coming to this so pega is developed using the j2a environment so j2a environment means so which is designed using the java technology simply we can say pega is one application which is designed and developed using the java and this hosted uh, using this hosted application again we can develop new applications so using this hosted application we can develop new applications so we will not use java at the time of developing applications in pega see just pega is a java based application but we will not write a single line of code while designing a new application in pega so total designing and development will be drag and drop or point and click because everything is available in the pega tool so whatever the resources required for developing an application so all those things are available available in the pega tool itself so all those things are called as for example if you take java so in java we used to call them as libraries in java terminology we used to call them as libraries so the same thing if you take in pega these are called as rules here so in pega we used to call them as rules so all these rules are what so nothing but some classes so which are developed using the java only so what are the rules we are calling in pega all those are called as classes which are developed using the j2 environment or java technology we can say so like this <coughs> in pega so whatever so we develop so everything automatically in the back end it will automatically generate the java source code so here what type of applications we can develop means any type of web application means for example whatever we are developing using the java or dot net the same thing we can also do using the pega also so here we have to write the coding if you are using java dot net but in pega there is no need to write single line of code so just we have to explore the things so which are required for developing an application so using those inbuilt so everything is inbuilt in the pega itself so everything from designing to so development security administration testing so all those things are inbuilt in the pega tool itself so just we need to explore those resources and we have to use them whenever required and most of the applications so domains will be like this so mainly banking related banking domains health care so not only this insurance financial so enter sorry marketing so majorly so these type of domains will be there not only these domains any based any online based applications so any type of web application we can develop using the pega so there is no limitations in that so any type of domain it supports and in the real time this pega is also called as prpc tool so already i told you so what is it is also called as some bpm tool also i told you so what is the difference between this bpm tool or is there any separate modules so in pega there are no separate modules like that so these there are some modules but in the current so whatever pega so they are only using the so only one thing they are using that is pega bpm prpc so anything is same only so either bpm we can also call it as bpm pega prpc tool or we can call it as so bpm tool or we can also call as pega prpc tool so don't confuse so either if you call as bpm tool is also same or else even if you call as pega prpc tool is also same so everything is same only just the names will be 
so different so BPM means business process management and this PRPC means PEGA rules process commander so PEGA rules process commander means here so already I told you here in Java what we used to call we used to call them as libraries so but in Pega the same thing we used to call as rules so what are the built-in classes so what are the built-in classes which we have in Pega tool so all those we used to call as Pega rules so Pega rules are nothing but some classes which are built in Java and process commander means it is some storage engine or else we can say within the Pega tool in order to store all these built-in classes it is some storage area so normally in real time we used to call this Pega as a Pega PRPC tool and normally in the like in previously oh, two years or three years back it is also called as BPM or BRE tool so BPM or BRE tool means business process management or business rules engine tool <coughs> so the names are different names they are using so but everything is same only here so either we can call as BPM tool or Pega rules process commander and coming to the advantages over the so other technologies which are available in the market so why companies has to move with this Pega so instead of so there is so many other technologies like java.net is there but what is the advantage so when they go with this Pega technology so some of the see in the current market so when I compare in the BPM market so there is no other tool in the so BPM category so which is which can give competition to this Pega tool so there are so many tools are there but all are having very less features when we compare with the Pega BPM tool so we can say this Pega is the present market leader so where no other tool is competition to this tool so there is some other tools like Lombardi uh, Oracle BPM but still so they are still suffering so to give some competition but so if suppose in Pega 10 applications are developed means if in Lombardi or Oracle BPM one application so the ratio will be like this like 1 is to 10 ratio so in the present market in the BPM market so for this Pega there is no competition uh, but when we compare in other technologies like Java or .NET for example I will compare this Pega with the Java technology and tell you some of the differences or so advantages over this Java technology for example let's take Java so in Java we have to write the coding and everything so if you want to develop a sim simple form so for that simple form also so where we have to design the code so which will take so like one hour or two hours so the same thing if we develop in Pega so we can compute within five minutes because directly we will create a property and all the user interface will be available so just by drag and drop we can design the total UI so I will show you how so drag and drop will be done so here so the development time is very less when we compare with the other technologies either Java or .NET so at the same time so cost also reduced so both development time is very less and the time of so cost is also very less simply saying cost means here you know, cost comes under so production cost so manpower so all those things also will be reduced when we so develop the same application in the Pega technology for example here application same application if you are developing in Java and Pega if it is taking two years time here we can complete that same application in so within one year we can complete that application so that is the reason is so here we will not write any coding everything is built in, in the tool so using those services so the development time is very fast here and also so many advantages like uh, so um, like maintainability costs not only this so reduction of errors so uh, duplicates 
so all those things I will give you one document about all those features so which all comes under BPM actually so this is one of the main advantage and also another advantage is so database configuration so when we develop any web application compulsory database is required so even in PEGA also so I will tell you what are the databases it supports and what are the servers it supports I will tell you after this so coming to the database here so if you use Java means we ha there we have to manually configure the database but here in PEGA so the database configuration is automatically created so the setup is here created automatically so how automatically means I will tell you so because here along with the PEGA software so it will automatically install the database means the database will be internal to the PEGA tool itself so normally if we install any database in Java means so externally we have to install the database and we have to manually configure it with the Java but in PEGA the database setup is created automatically and the database is <coughs> available internal to the PEGA tool only so when we log into the tool internal to the PEGA tool itself will have the database so that is one advantage and it supports all the databases so what are the databases we have it supports all the databases in the market so based on the requirement application requirement so they can select the required database from the list of available databases so that one I will show what are the supported databases and all so similarly servers also it supports all application servers available in the market and that is one more difference and are also advantage over the Java technology at the same time mm, security wise and performance wise if we compare with the Java so it is Java this PEGA provides so more security and gives better performance because in PEGA most of the applications are banking related only excuse me so actually in PEGA technology so most of the applications are related to banking finance insurance so when we develop these kind of applications so automatically so they are providing more security and at the same time so better performance over the so traditional programming languages like java or dotnet so that is one more feature or we can say one more advantage over java at the same time maintenance costs so normally if we take the java technology so that the maintenance cost will be so very high and also the cost also the time of so time taken for doing this maintenance applications is also so at the same time so the totally when we consider a maintenance application in java there the total time it is taken and the cost of production is taken is very high but the same thing if we convert to the PEGA <coughs> so here it will reduce around 60% of the so cost whatever it is taking in the Java technology so because so here what happens is so automatically everything is automatically so configured in the backend no need to manually so do changes to every module here so one to one is connected in the backend automatically so that is the reason means so business logic is so when we take these three categories so business logic application server and database so all these things three things are so setup is created automatically in the backend so if you are doing changes in the business logic again there is no need to rerun the database or server so automatically it will save 